How's it going, Chip Tribe? It's me, Chips, back with another episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. In the last episode, we uh, we came back from quite a long hiatus. Uh, these people are in the way. We came back from quite a long hiatus and fought a big boss. He was called Giga Gaia, I think, something like that. Uh, and it took a couple of tries, but we got him. We got him, and now uh, we found out that uh, I'm still... I'm kind of hazy on the story, because uh, it's been a while, but uh, basically, the the queen of this land, Zeal, has been corrupted by Lavos, uh, and she is trying to use a machine uh, in this uh, place called the Ocean Palace, which they just finished building, to bring him back, and we gotta go stop her. So, now comes the point where we have to remember where the Ocean Palace is, or, uh, it's very possible we've never been- oh, this is not the right- this was the mountain. Dude, I'm about to straight up Google this. I'm gonna do it. Just for- How to get to the Ocean Palace. Chrono Trigger. Use the portal thing in Zeal's room to get to the Ocean Palace. My god. It was in the castle the whole time. And I'm sure, if it hadn't been so long, they'd probably show me that. And I just forgot. So let's try this again. That was uh, 15 minutes well spent. So let's do this. All right, and now back in here, small cave. You can teleport from one side of the cave to another. These guys really, they really like their teleportation technology. All right, where is Zeal's room? I'm guessing it's in the middle. Oh, it's gotta be that right there. All right here, this seems very throne room-esque. If this ain't it, Oh, well, there's a save thing here, so that's gotta be a good sign. We got these two gentlemen here, those two ladies. Oh, this is it. Oh, this guy! Hmm. Why is that prophet allowed inside while I'm stuck guarding a palace like this? Ah, you came. I decided to leave you alone before. Hoping you might uh, make that prophet show his true colors. But I've no use for you anymore. Oh, are you gonna fight him? Your history! Okay. Let's uh, just get some attacks in here. Uh, late. Oh, Robo Tackle. That sounds fun. Yeah, grip. Oh. So the question is, does that having HP work like... Oh, every time I attack him, he does that. Okay. So I want to cure beam frog, and then I can attack with frog. And then miss with the... Uh... Oh, he even attacks me if I miss? Oh, oh, he, it's not. Uh, the counterattack missed. Am I missing everything because he said, Go ahead, try and attack me. Yeah, okay, so it does work like Super Fang. Where, uh... It has what you currently have, not half of your total. Well, heal. Uh, okay. Can you dodge magic as well? No, you cannot. This guy's actually not that threatening if that's the only attack he does. Because it's just going to keep having me. Cure beam on frog. 
Uh, it's lightning. It's lightning too. I think the only difference is it damages more people. There's only one dude here, so. Let's uh, water you. Okay. This is a lot easier of a fight than the last one. For now, at least. Well, Chrono's almost dead. But, uh... Let's cure beam Chrono. And let's heal everyone. Why not? And then we lightning. And we keep on keeping on. Also, I should put this down here. So you can see Dalton's nice throne. I don't think it's his throne. It's probably Zeal's throne. Dalton, you kind of suck. Alright, not attack. Let's lightning. Uh, let's water. Cure beam. No, no. He didn't really leave Robo alone. Is that because Robo is not attacking him? If I had to guess, alright, Frog needs, uh... Health. It's literally just gonna keep doing half. It's like I can get to one. Cure beam. Does lightning two do more damage? I don't know. That makes sense, but no, it is about the same. Okay, do I even need to- the question is... Well... Robo can't really do anything else. I'm assuming. Unless Laser Spin can do some damage, but... Theoretically... As long as I have more than one HP... On any of these guys... He's only done this one attack... I won't die. Oh, okay, okay. Am I dead? Yes and no? <laughs> okay, Robo got a level. Frog launcher? Bubble breath? Hold up, hold up. No! I can't be beaten! Not with eternal life within my grasp! Well, that's not good. Oh! Did he do that, or is he getting sucked? Oh my god. Alright, well, um... I would normally end off the episode there, but... Uh, since I'm probably gonna end up cutting most of my wander... Aimless wandering... Uh, I will keep going. And also use a, a shelter. Alright. Let's go. Into the portal. Which, this is a time portal, I believe. Or maybe it's not. Well. This seems like... Oh, there's another save thing here. Okay. Why not? Let's save again. Okay. Oh, Mune! I feel dark energy filling this place. Something frightening stirs. Uh, yeah, it's Lavos. Shala! Race the output of the Mamma Machine toward the limit! Shala? You dare disobey me? Very well, Mother. Shala, don't do it. Oh, what splendor! Behold the incredible power of Lavos! Ugh. Who's this prophet? I don't know if we know him yet. Alright. Shala, I'm coming, but first, I want to fill out this map. It makes me feel good.
Look at that. Look at that nice filled in map. Try this little corner. Yeah, yeah, good, good. Get the sides here. Get the sides, shot while I'm coming. I'm doing something real important. Okay. I'll help you out. Okay, so this is a full on temple. With these guys, Jin and Ghoul. Um, okay. Frog launcher. Yes! Please do a lot of That sucked! Alright, let's... Um... Okay, so... I'm guessing... Purple one is weak to magic, green one's weak to physical attacks. Oh, green one is weak to nothing. Uh, okay, well I'll just take out the... I'll keep on lightning too. I'll take out ghoul. Oh, that was a crit! So what is... Jin? I'm assuming this guy's Jin. Oh, he was she... Oh, this is ghoul. I was Google shielded Jin. I don't know. The crit like that. There we go. Okay. So we just had a shield. Learn triple attack. Triple tech. Uh, yes. Okay, so we come out here. These guys are gonna. Ooh, and that guy. Let's. Uh, what is? Triple to, oh, I gotta wait for Robo to... Trip oh, I can't because he's... Oh my god, he's confused. Okay, you can just attack. You laser spin everyone. Oh, it heals those guys. That's not good. Counters non-fire magic. Don't magic these guys. Also, Robo's dead! Wait! 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 Wait a second, wait a second. How do I revive people? How do I revive people? Yikes! <laughs> I was not ready for that. Okay, this is, uh... No joke. Let's load this up. Okay, we just gotta do this again. We gotta fight those guys again, but that's fine. Jin and Ghoul. Oh, we gotta watch this cutscene again. Oh, you did this baby very well. Oh, I'm turning on the machine. That prophet has gotta be someone. Who is that? Magus? Was like the dude? I bet it's him. Alright, where do I go this way? Well, I gotta fight these guys. Okay. Got it. I did decent damage. With my laser spin them. That heals them. Okay, don't do that. Counters non-light magic. Don't magic these guys. Oh, only magic them based on the color. Got it. So, does light mean the same as lightning? I don't know. I guess I could find out, but... 10,000 hertz sleep. Yes, that's lightning. Lightning. Is he gonna be super weak to that? Yes. Okay. So, the color that those two guys are is what they're weak to. Got it. Lesson learned. Rune blade? Um, yes. Oh. But the Masamune crit thing is really... I think I'm gonna keep the Masamune. It's the story sword. You gotta go with it. 
All right, so I should be able to just lightning two, and these guys are done. Maybe not done right here, but uh... no, nope, they're done right there. Got it. All right, a Aeonian Aeonian suit. Aeonian. Uh, that sounds sick. Yeah. My magic defense goes down. Let's put it on. Yeah. And you can have this. Alright. What do we got for time? We'll keep going a little bit. <coughs> if my voice can handle I'm not used to recording this much. Alright, so it looks like this is just a big room. So don't attack these guys with any magic. Just go in, deal some damage. Nice. And that's enough to take them out. Can they even attack without countering? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, uh, they can. Sap. Oh, that does a lot. Okay. Let's take that guy out. So, <clears throat> blue of these guys, yellow, and I think purple is Robo. He's like Shadow, if I remember. Those are the guys we can beat, no problem. Um, if I just sneak around, yeah, I don't, I don't have to step on the button. Okay. I'm gonna, yeah, confuse that. And we'll just, we don't have fire, we don't have Luca with us right now, so. Just laying on this guy. Sap. Crimson Rain Sap. That sounds scary. All right. Oh, got a level. Very good. Aeonian Helm. Uh, helm, yes. Look at that. And you actually are good, and you're good. Okay. Um, let's use some uh, some items because we are we are hurting. There we go. I guess I could use cure beam. Uh, I kind of forgot you could use those. Okay. Is this the same room? Let's just... So do we have to kill the other guy? Is Ghoul... Oh my god! Is Ghoul like shielding... I'm... Yeah, okay. So we gotta take out Ghoul first. The Jin's being protected by Ghoul's shield. Alright, so it's still last of the Robo's one little attack. That's fine. See, I'm learning how these guys fight. I'll get back into it. Well, these guys I never fought before, so. Okay. Don't really. Oh, that was the same room. Oh, I literally walked out this door, fought these guys, and then walked right back in. I'm dumb. No! That guy's who I want to attack. Not the little flying dude. Alright. 
Now we attack the flying dudes. I still don't have a triple attack. I should do that. Just to see how cool it looks. Okay, Crimson Rain. Yeah, yeah, do your thing. Now. That guy's dead. Come on. Yo, Sap! I just noticed what it does. It slowly drains Robo's health. <laughs> Never noticed that last time. Or I did and I forgot that I noticed it. There's nothing in here, even. There's gotta be something in- oh, there was an item. Right, right. Okay. Let's uh, go to text. Can I use- No, I can't use her. Yeah, okay. I thought I could cheese it for a little- A little, little bit there, but I cannot. That's fine. Okay. Oh, there's a door there. Oh, it's the same room. What? Okay. Let's... Okay. Now we just beat up these guys again. Why? Did it just bring me to the same area? I don't understand. But, you know, I guess there's some experience on these guys. Does lock mean uh, I can't do dual or triple techs? I thought it was like confusion. Or like maybe he'll sometimes attack us. But it doesn't seem to be the case. And it says lock, not confuse. This guy's still alive? Come on. There we go. Alright. Frog got a level, Robo got a level. Love to see it. Oh my god, I did not notice. Oh, jeez. I was gonna show that I didn't notice that was a way to go. Oh my god. Oh my god. I had to fight these idiots again. I don't want to. Come on. Oh. Red Scouters, these guys, I'm about to put Luca in the party just so I don't have to deal with these idiots. That's actually probably a good idea, because I haven't seen any of these guys besides yellow and purple, or yellow and red. So having a fire is probably good. But uh, we'll see, maybe I'll do that in between. Or maybe we'll see more guys like that, and I will feel... Yo, heal beam? What? What just happened with heal beam? I was matching A. I didn't see what happened. Oh, heal beam's a new thing. Stores a small amount of HP to all allies. Heck yeah. Let's do that right now. So it's not as potent as cure beam, but it does it to everyone. Gotta love it. Alright, Robo Stan. I take it back. I love how in this, like, in a lot of RPGs, you have, like, one character that is the healer. But in this, it seems like... Oh, see? Are these blue or purple? Let's see. Blue. So I attack. I water. And I attack. Um, yeah, I was saying, uh, it seems like anyone... Like, everyone's got healing moves of some no 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 heck like robo's got healing moves frog's got heal uh marl has got healing moves it's good it's, i like it because it's not like uh you know in a lot of games it's like all right this is the healer so they're gonna be in my party literally all the time also new equipment for robo Let's go. Alright. Oh, we got a red and a blue. And this guy. Alright, so 
attack you. Let's water you. And then Robo is going to attack the middle guy. And we'll be good. I'm assuming those guys are the most dangerous. I always take them out first. Um, it seems like a uh, prudent strategy. I don't, I like, I don't know if we just got two crits in a row, if that's the new animation for the new arm, with the little sparklies. I don't like it. Alright. Um. What does this do? I don't know. I don't know what that did. <laughs> um, okay, we'll fight these guys. I'm probably gonna end off the episode soon. Um, okay, so, attack you, water you, attack you. I feel like ending off an episode in the middle of a dungeon is not a great idea, but that's why I want to do it. I want to snag that item, and then I'll, uh, I'll end it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It does damage and drains your health. That's nasty. Look at that. It goes down pretty fast. Except when animations are happening. Alright, we got another lapis. What is in this chest? Sonic bow. Uh, I believe Marl's got the bows. Whoa! That is a good increase. Okay. Um, so I think with that, I'm going to end off this episode right here in this random corner of this dungeon. But if you guys did enjoy, as always, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Tune in next time when we are going through this ocean palace. We got to save Princess Shala. We got to stop them from uh, awakening Lalos. Uh, even though we are also, we have to try and stop Lalos before he comes to begin with. It is a whole thing, but, uh... I will see you guys in the next episode. But until then, don't forget to take it easy.